Thank you guys so much for checking us out online. I am that girl, Fel from Power 98.3. Join now with a couple of friends, some new friends. I'm about to get to know them. What's your name? Christine Workham. Okay. And I have Red here, who is a black back jackal. Okay, and I noticed your shirt from the Wildlife World Zoo Aquarium Safari Park, one of my favorite places. I haven't been in so long, so I'm kind of excited to talk to you today. Um, but tell me about this little cute guy. So this is Red. This is a black back jackal, and okay. Red's a little over a month old full grown these jackals get about 30 pounds so they're a little bit smaller than the coyotes we have here <laughs> so a part of the canine family can i can i pass? yes you right. can oh. yeah. very sweet at this age okay so these are new to the zoo or have they been there or how long have they been there so they're relatively new we have the parents in safari park and okay. we had two litters and oh. red's part of one of the litters we have some of the pups out with the parents and some of them in our baby animal nursery and these animals are one of the few mammals that actually make for life oh my goodness okay so what do they eat like do they just eat anything and everything pretty much pretty much they're medium-sized uh, carnivore yeah they'll uh, mainly eat meat but they will be an opportunistic omnivore, so they'll eat berries and plants and things like that when they come across it and they're hungry. Are they very active? Do they play around a lot? So if people go, do they very just, are they sleepy, lazy, sleeping all the time, or do they just play with each other? The little pups are so much fun to watch. When you come to our baby animal nursery, we have full panel acrylic where you can <laughs> sit there. The kids love it because you're so close to the glass mm -hmm. and they're playing. They are little rascals at this age. They're <laughs> all over the place, just full like of energy. Kids. Just like Absolutely. Just like toddlers. Okay. And they do well in the summertime, right? They Obviously. do. Yeah, a lot of African animals, a lot of Australian animals do really well because our climate kind of lends our, them, lends itself to mm -hmm. that kind of environment. Okay. One more time, just remind everybody of the hours uh, for the, because I think I was actually calling you guys one of the days because I think it was kind of overcast and I didn't know if you guys were still open or not, but you guys were, so. Yes, we're open every single day of the year. We open at nine o'clock in the morning and the zoo stays open till six o'clock in the evening and the aquarium stays open till nine o'clock at night. So even when it warms up, you can come out in the morning, spend the day walking around the zoo and when it gets too hot, make your way over to the aquarium. Checking out Red and his family playing around in there. So cute. I'm going to have to take a picture with you. Look at that little nose. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you guys so much for stopping by. Make sure you guys check them out. The Wildlife World Zoo Aquarium and Safari Park. You guys, thank you so thank much. Thank you for having us.